Hello there, and welcome to my channel, or welcome back if you're a regular. You know the drill, all these incredible, lovely people on screen right now are my patrons, because without them, uh, you, you wouldn't have a video to watch right now, and I wouldn't have a job, so I think they deserve a massive thank you for giving me so much support. The ones in gold have been here a whole year. Like, what? Ah! I, I, I don't feel worthy. Ah! <laughs> Anyways, thanks for making it this far. Let's roll the video. Hello, welcome to another video, a new toy video. Look, I have a table. Now I'm sure a lot of you remember good old Toys R Us. Yes, it is much of memory now. Toys R Us has shut down. RIP in RIP says Toys R Us. But the good thing about Toys R Us shutting down is they had some crazy sales towards the end there. So during those sales, I picked up this. It is a special Toys R Us exclusive catch them all surprise that apparently has two of them in there. I mean, because this is the same size box as the single hatch them all, so I don't know what's going to be compromised here. Will they not have as many features? Will they be smaller? Or maybe this box is TARDIS, who knows? But I guess we should probably get into it. Please excuse my hands while I use scissors. Need to be safe, you know? She says using scissors incorrectly. Probably should have done this before starting the camera. Yay! Again, we have another fake egg, and this fake egg is useless to us. Buy a box, nothing else in there. And here we have our egg. Now it's a lot more oblong than the other one. It's a lot taller. A bit more like pill shaped. Kind of like an insect egg, actually. <laughs> oh, look at this! It comes with tiny little beds. Look! An itty bitty pink bed. <laughs> That's so cute. It says something like that on the box. Hang on. Come back, box! We did you! I didn't mean it. Yeah, because on the box it says bone attachable nests inside, but it doesn't really show you them because it's got the attachable sitting on top of them. <laughs> I just thought we we're just going to have to use the egg as a nest again, but no, they actually gave us tiny little nest beds. That's so nice. And because it's a twin, we get two of them, so that's super nice. And here we have our eggy. It doesn't want to come out of the plastic. Come here. Oh, right, there we go. Ooh. Ooh, it's a lot heavier than the first one. Really, really chunky. Get rid of this little plastic cap. And get rid of that. Hey, bits of paper and important things. I'm gonna need my hands again to get into this. Oh, wow, the book it's come with is really thick this time around. And what, what, why do we have so many of these? What is all this? What, why, why do I have all this? Oh, it's all different languages. Okay, I need the English. Where is the English? Uh, not that one. Not that one. Yep, yep, yep. Nope, 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 nope. Ah, there it is. Sorry, other languages, I cannot read you. Ha. Oh, no, excuse me. Thank you. Oh, and that's why we've got so much white as well. They've done the same thing with all this. Nope, 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 nope. Hey, there we go. <laughs> we got it. I hope there's nothing else in there I needed. Getting started. Stage one, Hatchimal egg. When you first get the Hatchimal egg out of the box, turn it on, remove the twist locks located at the bottom of the egg, Discard the twist lock. What if I want the twist lock? Well, I'm gonna break the rules and not display them. I'm gonna keep them forever, because I'm a rebel like that. Ha ha ha. Ah, there we go. And we have life! Here we go again. Nurture your egg until we are ready to hatch. You can tilt, tap, or touch the egg. Oh, is it gonna do like the tap thing again? Oh, right, there it is! Yay! Where's the lights coming from? I can't see the lights. Hello? Please show your lights. Hello, please do the light thing. So there's a lot more to do in this hatching stage because we've actually got like colors. But I'm not seeing where this color is supposed to be coming from. I don't see anything. Maybe the lights are just too good in my recording room here. Oh yeah, I'm in a new recording space as well. Um, it's more towards the front of the house, so sorry if you hear like cars going by. No, I think I saw a little bit of color. Hang on. No, no, I didn't. I'm just going crazy. See, the other thing I don't get with this one is where's the surprise part? Because with the single hatch moles, you gotta get one of two different colors. You don't know which one it's gonna be. With this, you get both. Like, there was no other color options other than what's on the box. So, what's the surprise? I mean, unless both of them are gonna be the same color, that's the only thing I can think of. Ah. Give me a light or something. Maybe it's got a faulty one. This one just doesn't have any lights on it. Cause like, I, I even tried turning off the lights and having a look at it and there's nothing. So I'm very confused. Again, Hatchimals really like being thrown. It's a little concerning. You nearly died. How do you feel? Oh, very happy about that apparently. 
<laughs> oh dear. All right, looks like we're finally hatching. Come on. Fall on asleep. No, no, no sleeping. Only hatching. Yes. All right, oh wait, we've got to we got to do stuff in this stage. All right, rub the bottom of the egg to help us hatch. Okay. Rub, 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 rubbing, rubbing. Oh, once they push their way out the top of the egg. Okay, they're coming out of the top this time. That's good to know. Oh, it's buzzing. Something's happening. They better not just like shoot out like a party popper and scare the daylights out of me, I swear. Oh, oh, here they go. Ah, uh, I see so much fluffy things. <laughs> so they've added like cracking sound effects now. <laughs> this is so cute. I like this better than the going around the tapping thing. Oh, look at him. I can see some eyeballs. Ooh, we got like rainbow we want. That's really cute. <laughs> Let me help. There we go. Look, oh, you're so cute. Oh, he's so fluffy. And tiny. I don't even know which one this is, because like, that one's got blue ears and this one's got green ears. We got purple ears. What's happening? Oh, I see. On the back, he's got purple ears, so. You need help? I mean, I, I need help. Hang on. <laughs> Yay! Oh, That's so cute. Can I get the other one? Let's get your, your twin out, shall we? Oh, the twin actually has different colored ears. That's interesting. Egg pieces everywhere. Look, it's like egg confetti. Whee! Oh no. There's no sound coming out of this one. Um, um, nurse, nurse! Wait, he's gonna switch, hold up. And they're like, oh, oh, there we go. Oh, oh, get away. There we go. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, he's gonna go straight to sleep. <laughs> Same. Free the other one. Scissors. My very own little sparkle dogs. <laughs> it's so fluffy as well. Like the material is a lot better than the other ones. No, you both just don't want to talk to me. Look at these little babies. Yes, yes. Look how much his head goes down. It must be for like the hatching is like bib, 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 bib. <laughs> oh, okay, so the tw they do different things. So twin A has eye color, twin B, eye color and sound. How do I know who's A and B? Oh no, there's literally a thing. It's like, can't tell us apart. Look for the A or B on our bottoms to see which twins we are. Yeah. Oh, okay, so this one's A. So that's A, that's B. Oh, he moves his head. Ah! Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> oh, oh my heart. Look at that. Ah! <laughs> that's so cute. Oh. What does that mean? Okay, now he's born. <laughs> Happy birthday, little Hatchimal. You two, please don't sue me. Then we can put them in their little beds. They're so cute. <laughs> They're way cuter than I thought they would be. Hang on, what was this one doing? Your, your twin B, solid blue. Curious. Press head button or press nose. Oh, they got buttons on their nose. Beep. Uh, needs to burp. Press head button or tilt. This is so much more stressful for two of them. <laughs> what do you want? So it's It looks like. Twin B is a bit more limited in like his eye colors because he's only going blue and pink and this one's got like the whole spectrum. And they feel smaller, but they're actually a little bit bigger than the last one. Oh, look at that little, little Hatchimal family. <laughs> oh, they kissed each other. Oh, oh that's so cute. I didn't know they have like interactivity between the two of them. Because I was thinking maybe I could like give one away, but... I don't think I should do that because they interact with each other. They kind of need each other. So I think that's it for the uh, Bakari Cam segment of this video because from here it takes forever to get them to the final stage. So, um, here is goodbye from Bakari. Thank you for watching. Cut to Dizu Cam from the future. Approximately 10 hours later. Uh, we're finally at the kids stage, it took forever and they sang happy birthday in harmony when they grew up and it was the cutest I wish I could have on camera. So now we have all the games, so let me show you. They've got some games that'll do just on their own and they have some games that they do together. So with, with twin A, we press and hold his head, he should go into dance mode. He's dancing, look at him go. I like the little music, the music's cute. <laughs> And by the way, if you hold their nose as you turn them on, it actually starts them in half volume mode. So parents take note. No, let, let, let's compare. So you've got full volume. And then you've got half volume. Much nicer, <laughs> much less piercing. And then twin B does the same like record and repeat thing as the other Hatchimal. So hold his head. Like, hello, hello, recording, hello. 
What <laughs> one game they do together is called skits. Well, I'm not entirely sure what that one is. Right, so we face them. It says press twin A's nose. So they kind of just do a cute little talky thing together. So those are the toddler stage games. Then we've got the adult stage, sorry, kid stage games. It's weird with kid being the last stage. So we hold his nose. And he starts going to game mode. So red will be for tag. So I'm going to pat his head when he goes red. There you go. Nope. Nope. There we go, that's pretty basic. And the blue game is Hatchimal Says. So red, pat head, pink, press nose, blue, turn upside down. Upside down. Upside down. <laughs> yeah, upside down. It just looks like upside down. Oh, red is pat head. Yeah, you get you get the gist. <laughs> Twin B has the other two with the, the silly sounds and the psychic catchmall where we can ask him a question. Alright, psychic catchmall. Will this video do well? Oh, well that's nice. <laughs> we get the tappy one. Alright, then the together games. Alright, so this first one is freeze tag, so twin A here is going to dance. But if we hold twin B's head, uh, he should stop. <laughs> so the head tilting mechanism in twin A is starting to go a bit wonky already. See, how far away can they be for this to work? That still works. That's so cool. <laughs> Serenade. So just press Twin B's head to play faster music, press the nose to play slower music. Look, their eyes are flashing in time with the beat. This last game is probably my favorite. Uh, it's called Harmonize. So you press their heads and they will sing notes in harmony. Isn't that cool? <laughs> that is the Twin Hatchables, and that's all their games. So they still do the emotions and stuff while they're like just in play mode, so you can, they'll still get sick and be sad. You gotta fix that. So there's still lots of playability there. And just because I love you guys and Hatchables so much, I'm actually gonna do a giveaway! Woo! Giveaway! I have lots of little Hatchimal collectibles, like you know, these things. So they're tiny itty bitty eggs, and you actually have to like warm them up and crack them open. There's a tiny little figurine inside. So I will give away a bunch of these. So if you want to enter the giveaway in the comments below, pick a name for these two, because that's something we haven't done yet. I haven't named them, and I am, frankly, stuck on ideas. <laughs> so pick a name for them, let me know in the comments, and also put the word Sparkle Dog in your comment somewhere so that I know that you want to enter the competition. And then I will randomly draw a winner uh, probably next week. I love these guys so much. I am enjoying these a lot more than the other kinds of Hatchimals that I've seen so far. They are just too cute. The way they interact is really, really fun. Um, just keep in mind, if you are giving them to, say, like, a set of siblings, because, you know, if there's two in there, you can have one each. Uh, twin B does significantly less <laughs> than Twin A, so if you give one to a child each, it, it's not going to be fair. <laughs> also, let me know in the comments if there is a new toy coming out or has come out that you'd like to see on this channel, because there is so much cool stuff coming out with Christmas just around the corner, so let me know what you'd want to have a look at. And here's the old one, come to say <laughs> hello. And he's happy that his beak isn't being destroyed by the green screen this time. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye!